NASA reveals wall project for turning a moon crater into a radio telescope. NASA just gave out a new round of grants for its favourite up and coming innovative space projects. One which is a plan to fit a one kilometre or 3,281 foot radio telescope inside a crater on the far side of the moon. The Lunar Crater Radio Telescope, LCRT, would be able to measure wavelengths and frequencies that can't be detected from Earth, working unobstructed by the ionosphere or our EMF noise. Here is a free rend rendering of a Lunar Crater Radio Telescope, or LCRT. Per, 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 per plans, moon rovers would pull out a wire mesh some one kilometre across inside a lunar crater, then could be up to five kilometres or 3.1 miles in diameter. A suspended receiver in the centre of the crater would complete the system. Everything could be automated without any human operators, which would in turn mean a lighter and less expensive payload for the project to get off the Earth. This is still at the very early stage of planning, and it's not clear yet exactly which crater would be used for the job, but it's an intriguing concept that we'll be keeping an eye on in the years ahead. The biggest radio telescope here on the Earth is a 500 metre percher spherical telescope or FAST, which has a 500 metre or 1640 foot diameter. When the LCRT happens, it will be double as wide. Here is a simple side on 2D representation of how this system would work. FAST is already proving its worth, having already picked up mysterious FAST radio bursts also known as FRBs, from the depths of space. The LCRT proposed here has the potential to find even more phenomena. There's now such an abundance of low Earth orbit satellites listening to the cosmos from the surface of the Earth is becoming very difficult. Low frequencies in the 6 to 30 megahertz frequency band would be the LCRT's speciality. Thanks for watching. My name is Timothy. Please like and share. Your comments are most welcome as well.